On Thursday, Colorado Parks and Wildlife backpacked 1,000 trout just over a half mile to St. Mary's Lake. Through the Parks and Wildlife stocking program, uh, stocking cutthroat around the state, puts fish in these high alpine lakes and allows anglers to go and, and fish for them. It's important not only when it comes to preservation of fish populations, but fishing alone contributes around $2.4 billion to the state annually, and it supports more than 17,000 jobs. And as part of Parks and Wildlife, you know, that's one of our mandates is to provide angling opportunities. There's also another goal in releasing the trout here. The lake is crowded with smaller brook trout. The tiger trout is part brown trout, known for eating smaller fish. The tiger trout will eat the brook trout and kind of reduce their numbers so they grow better. And then also provide another different kind of cool fish to catch. These trout will grow to be between 6 and 12 inches and can live up to 8 years. When you're fishing a high alpine lake and catching fish, don't take it for granted. There's a lot of work through our hatchery system that goes into raising these fish. And Thursday's mission? Successful, yes. CPW stocks about 90 million fish every year across the state, including right here. Reporting from St. Mary's Lake, Jamie Leary, CBS4 Mountain Newsroom.